Hey guys, the Cube Dude here, and today I'll be going over where I've been, what I've been doing, and what I have planned for the future of this channel. So I started college in 2014, and I thought I could keep up with the video making all throughout college. However, after my freshman year, I joined a fraternity, I got a girlfriend, I sort of started taking my academics more seriously, and so that sort of took up my entire life. Uh, and while I haven't been very active in the YouTube side of cubing, I've been extremely active in the competition side of things. Uh, I've been organizing all the Puget Sound competitions as I've attended the University of Puget Sound uh, the last few years and I was added on to the World Cube Association Regulation Committee, the WRC, in March of 2017 and just recently I was added on as a delegate, which is definitely one of the highlights of my cubing career. Since then, I've graduated with two degrees in math and business. I have just recently moved to Washington to live with my girlfriend and a few other friends as she has one more year left. Uh, now you guys will be seeing her in the next video. So my next video will be a Q&A, where Colleen will be asking me the questions that you guys leave down below, as well as on Facebook. There are multiple platforms where you can ask me these questions. They can be about cubing, they can not be about cubing, they can be directed towards myself or her as she'll be reading them to me. Either way, we will be sure to answer these as honestly as possible and try and get to as many of them as we can. One of the last few things I wanna to touch on in this update video is I recently started a website. It's techcubedude.com. You can find that down below. It's just my YouTube channel name.com. And there you can see my competition schedule so you guys can follow along with any announced competitions that I'm plan planning on going to, as well as some unannounced competitions uh, that are most likely going to be happening uh, sometime soon, as well as the OLL and PLL algorithms I use, my personal bests through cubepb.com, which if you guys have not heard, it's a new service the Cubicle provides where you can keep track of uh, all of your personal bests and sort of follow other users and follow their personal bests. I definitely recommend it. You can find that on my website as well. Uh, and on there, you can also find a blog where I go over my thoughts and comments on any competitions I go to. I generally will post that the day after a competition that I attended. You can find all that information as well as my Facebook page where you can also leave questions down in the description. So as I've been gone for so long, YouTube has changed in the last few years. Now, when you hit the subscribe button by default, it only notifies you of some videos. So if you'd like to be notified of all of my future videos, go ahead and click on the bell next to it. I recommend doing that for all the channels that you guys follow on a regular basis. It definitely will support them and it will also keep you up to date with all the new videos. So don't forget to leave all your questions down below for myself and Colleen, whether it's about cubing or not cubing, we'll go ahead and answer those within the next week. For you guys, you can also ask them on Facebook once again. Check out my website if you have time and I'm very, very happy to be back. I have a lot of videos in plan for the summer uh, and so look forward to those. If you have any other ideas of what content you'd like to see on my channel now that I'm coming back, go ahead and leave that in the description as well. Look forward to the Q&A video within the next week. I hope you all enjoyed and thanks for watching.